Lately, I have been picking a lot of wallets that you guys are recommending, and these two happen to be a great pick under 500 rupees, which are slim, sexy, functional, and great for travelers. Let's check them out. Hi, my name is Ayan, and on this channel, I talk about tech, travel, transform. So, if you resonate with any of that, do smash that subscribe button. Talking about traveling, I am always on the lookout of great wallets that I can take on my trips. And lately, you guys have been recommending two of these wallets, which I found on Amazon India. And these two really are great, amazing wallets, which we will be unboxing in a minute but i won't be using it for everyday carry usage i would rather be using it on my trips let's move to the overhead camera unbox it and i'll share my opinions on each of them and we'll compare them side by side all right so firstly we are checking this wallet by a company called hammond's fly capture and this is the packing it looks good it looks premium i think it can be easily uh, be a good gift for someone who might be looking for a new wallet so on the packing it says since 2007 so it's good to know uh, it's a minimal packing nothing more so let's move inside so this is the first time of me opening this wallet and right here you can see that it says RFID protected which is always great to see in today's time all the wallets should be at least RFID protected and here we get a small protective sort of a paper and we can slide the wallet out like this so this one is in the navy blue color and this uh, wallet comes in eight different colors I will put it up in the screen so you can choose which one you want uh, the leather looks are really amazing the pattern feels really really good and really premium so on the front you have the HF branding. I think that's the company logo Hammond's Fly Catcher. It's not extremely subtle, but it's also not catching up in the eye, so that's okay. So yeah, let's take a look on the outside. The leather feels good, and uh, this wallet comes at rupees, so I think under 400 rupees, uh, depending on when you are buying it from the Amazon. So yeah, the prices keep changing, but I'm gonna put all the links in the description below so you can check it out. But you can easily pick this wallet under 400, 500 rupees, and for that price money, the uh, leather looks really good. The stitching feels okay. It's not that great uh, but it's not going anywhere i could see that uh, there are some extra thread coming out but uh, that's okay so a good part about this wallet and why i'm recommending it for a travel category wallet is because it has this sort of a uh, uh, opening this button opening uh, and this button really gives you a sense of extra security that your money is safe your cards are not uh, you know coming out of it easily and yeah that being said we are inside the wallet and here it's also mentioned rfid protection I'm not a huge fan of this sort of a thing why they have to engrave it inside. They can just put it on the packet and here they mention genuine leather. Again, the snap button is really good but these two things feel unnecessary and it shouldn't be needed in my opinion. So this is the classic bifold design wallet and you can see there are two card slots on the either side. So you can put uh, four cards on the front at a very quick access thing right after the snap button which is really good. And then there are two sleeves on the either side to hold some of your ID cards and you know some parking tickets and whatnot. And again, it makes a great travel wallet because it also comes with a sleeve for the cash. So you can put some cash so especially when you are traveling, you need some foreign an exchange cash which you can put over here easily and i think uh, this design is inspired by one of the wallet that i had in the past from monbla so that is uh, a very very premium wallet and i can see that the inspiration might have come from that uh, but yeah I, overall the wallet looks really good it's rfid protected it comes in eight different colors it has a snap button so let's load it up fully and see how it looks and how it performs in the pocket all right so that's how the wallet looks all decked up as you can see i have filled it with the cash and the cards over here we have two cards over here we have two cards Underneath I have one of my ID card and over here I have my insurance card and also some extra loose cash. On the back I have some more cash so it's currently holding 8000 rupees INR in 500 rupees note. And unfortunately this cash sleeve is not uh, big enough for Indian currency. I have to fold this note in inside like this. So it cannot hold the Indian notes so over here fully. But I think it could easily hold more foreign currency note which are smaller in size. So yeah depending on where you are going this could be a really handy wallet. Let's put it in the pocket and see how it performs. So I'm always a front pocket wallet person so I'm putting it in the front pocket and yes this is slim this doesn't really cause much of a you know bump in the pocket and in the back I think I can carry it more easily though I don't prefer it I always prefer carrying wallet in the front so yeah uh, that is there uh, this is not really a bulky wallet but yeah when you are traveling you need a cash sleeve especially for me that's my requirement so I would highly recommend this uh, wallet if you are going for a small trip over one country but for a multi-day trip where you might be visiting multiple countries and want to hold some extra cash let's check out the next wallet all right so the next wallet we have is by this company called urban forest and again this wallet is coming at uh, under 500 rupees so the packaging is really good and in the packaging you can actually see the MRP is written 2000 rupees so uh, the packaging is good and it will make a great gift for anyone looking for this travel wallet so quickly unboxing it here we can see that it's protected by this paper film so let's take it out and we have a small card here uh, which basically says that this is a pure leather and if you 
uh, happen to claim it otherwise you can get uh, 10x of wallet amount 100x of wallet amount so yeah that's good to know that they are claiming it to be a good leather original leather so let's see why i'm recommending this for uh, travel wallet and you might be noticing right away that this is a trifold design i'm not a huge fan of trifold design but trust me uh, when you are traveling you really need to hold a lot of different things and uh, even though this is a trifold wallet it packs in really light as you can see comparing it to the previous wallet as you can see this is even you know smaller and lighter footprint compared to this one but we will take it up as well and we'll see how it performs but for now the material feels really premium i can assure that yes this is a great leather the stitching looks really good and comparatively to previous one the stitching is definitely better so this also comes in eight different colors and it's again rfid safe and you can see this has uh, three different compartments so starting from the left one we have uh, three card holders and we also have three card holders on the right most compartment then in the between we have a coin uh, pocket and this comes in really handy because when you are traveling you get a lot of extra coin you can put it over here you can just dump it over here and then we have one sleeve over here we have one sleeve over here we have one sleeve over here so total of three sleeves where you can easily put uh, some ex extra loose cash uh, id card some passport size photos and what not and the great part about this wallet is if you come to the back you will see there are two different uh, cash carrying sleeves so this makes it a great wallet for a multi day multi country trip where you can put uh, a currency of one country over here a currency of other country over here so i have also shown one of the wallet uh, in my previous videos from a company called quick brown fox which is unfortunately not uh, any more functioning a lot of people have been asking if they can get that wallet but because the company is no longer in existence i would recommend this as an alternative for that because that wallet also had uh, uh, these two different uh, cash carrying pockets so in my opinion this really makes a great travel wallet for example you are going to a trip on singapore and later on bangkok then you can put one currency of singapore over here and bangkok over here and then you can swap the currencies depending on where you are you can also put uh, some extra notes so let's say inrs over here and yeah let's deck it up and let's see how it performs so i don't have that many cards and that many currency note but let's see how much it can actually hold all right so we have it all decked up and even though it's completely full as you can see it's still having a very small form factor which i'm really really enjoying so definitely this is going to be my travel wallet for upcoming trips so let's check it out we have three cards over here we have three cards over here i don't have any coin as of now but i would definitely be using it to put my extra backup ub key or maybe some passport size photos over here i have my travel insurance card and over here i have some loose cash notes on the back it is easily carrying total of 15000 rupees as you can see in two different pockets so this make it a great wallet now let's test it out in the pocket itself so carrying it in the front pocket you can definitely feel some sort of a bulge happening over here but it's not really that huge it's not really that making you uncomfortable but i will definitely not carry it in the back pocket because uh, this will be really uncomfortable while sitting but overall i would say this is still really a very small form factor and a great wallet i really love the leather feel of this wallet so let's do a quick side by side comparison of both the wallets so this is by urban forest and this is by hammond flycatcher i really like the subtle branding of this wallet and i really love bulls in general so yeah i'm leaning towards this on the side on the back both wallets are quite subtle so opening up uh, i you can see this one definitely is smaller but it can carry less cash it's definitely bigger and it can carry multiple uh, currency notes so divided over two pockets and this can easily carry your cash entirely without folding it but for this you need to fold your cash so uh, definitely it has some drawbacks both of the wallet have genuine leather it comes under 400 rupees and rfid protected this one has a coin slot this doesn't have a coin slot this one has two sleeves and this one has three sleeves so overall if you are looking for a multi day trip my recommendation is the urban forest one but if you are looking for an everyday carry wallet which can also hold some certain cash then i would go for hammond flycatcher and i will also take it to a smaller trip let's say a week long trip where i don't have to carry much cash but yeah thank you for recommending me these wallets and if you have more recommendation do comment it below and i will try my best to review them so these were two great travel wallets under 400 rupees that you can get from amazon india if you want to check out more wallet recommendation then do check out this video and if you want to check out eight everyday carry items that every man should carry then definitely check out this video hope you like this video if you did do leave a like below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and on that note i'm going to see you in the next one